Greetings, and welcome to part two of the MetLogix M3 version three tutorial series. In part two, we will be discussing the topic of direct export of data to Excel. In the direct data export feature, the M3 is capable of opening a new worksheet in Excel and populating it with the data from the M3 measuring results. This new direct data export also ex supports opening of existing workbooks and populating data to its worksheets. There are two main methods of exporting data to Excel. We either export data to Excel directly from the report view to a new workbook, or we update existing worksheets using customization settings in the export dialog. By default, the direct Excel data export feature is not enabled in the M3. As with many of the other settings in the M3 software, the toolbar button must be displayed by setting the flag in the desktop settings screen. Navigate to desktop settings and set the display new Excel button to desktop. Once enabled, you should find two new items in the report view. The direct to workbook export button seen here and the export to existing sheet export option found in the exports menu. We will now do a quick demonstration of a direct data export to a new Excel worksheet. To demonstrate this, we'll create a quick part program and produce some measuring results. Okay, great. We now have some measuring results with which to export. Again, access the M3 report view and press the direct to data, direct to Excel data output button. The export data dialog will be displayed while the system opens and prepares the Excel sheet. As you can see, my measuring results data has been exported to the M3 software. In the next example, we will, we will export data and update an, exist, an existing workbook and worksheet. Again, we'll create a quick part program example with which to demonstrate. Again, access the data export uh, data report view. But in this case, we'll be using the export XLSX format option from the export menu. When pressed, we should be we should be presented with the export dialog as seen here. You can see in this example, the workbook and target worksheet items are already filled out. These have been remembered from the last export execution. To choose a new workbook and worksheet, simply select the workbook button from the bottom of the dialog, select the worksheet you'd like to update, and from the target sheet, you can select worksheets within the workbook that have already been created. There are a series of other settings that can be used in order to control the way in which the M3 software populates the worksheet. We will, we will cover these topics in detail in the user guide. However, for this example, we'll describe a few of these. The starting row offset is currently be set, been set to five. This will ensure that the system will automatically 
uh, will automatically begin the data population five rows down from the top of the worksheet. The column offset can be used in the same way for column offsets. Press done when we're ready to export data. As you can see, the M3 software has populated an existing Excel worksheet with the data from our report view. As mentioned, there is a series of other options available for exporting data from the M3 software directly to Excel. We will again call the export dialog using the export XLS button in the export menu. Some of the additional options available for export are to close the Excel software instance after export, print to the default printer from Excel after export. Use M3 text color is used to filter whether or not the feature result colors are passed into the Excel worksheet. Use M3 formatting is similar and will filter formatting from the M3 software to the Excel worksheet. Include column headers allows the export from Excel to either filter or show the column headers from the M3 in the exported data in Excel. These three features are typically used when exporting data into an existing formatted quality report in Excel. The sheet, limit button, the sheet limit setting can be used to set the number of new sheets that are created when appending data to an existing workbook in Excel. This functionality is also enabled using the append to existing data. This allows exports of measurement results from the M3 software to be added to the last entered report output in Excel. And finally, update copy will create a new instance of data in the Excel workbook that has been previously selected. As with all standard M3 data output options, the new directed Excel output can be recorded into a part program as a data step. This data step will appear in the program steps list just as any other export step would. To demonstrate, we'll create another quick example of a part program. We'll execute a direct to Excel export. and we will press the play button to convert to an M3 part program. As you can see, the export step is executed in playback. And that program step is also added to the program view. Thank you.